Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Gordon Xavier here today to share with y'all some good vibes, a little bit of love, and a couple of ideas that I know in my heart and my mind will aid you in your ability to communicate more effectively. So if you're ready for that, hit that like button and let's get started. So today our question comes from homeboy Arvis 3 run What's going on, Arvis? Arvis says in his comment, for some reason I am unable to think clearly when I am around other people. Nothing comes out when I have something to say, but afterwards I could think of a bunch of shit I could have said. So though what's going on, man? What's up with that? Yo, I can relate to that. I can relate to that 100%. I think a lot of people can relate to that right there. This is what happens, right? What he's experiencing, I experience, is when we're in social situations, we walk up to somebody, we're getting ready to engage, and next thing you know, it's like their energy, their, their presence has infiltrated our energy, you know, field, and then it's like reprogrammed us so that we can't even talk straight, or we can't even assert what it is that we are and what we want to assert. So how do we get to the place where we can just walk up to somebody and be grounded and strong in, the, in, up, in and of ourselves so that we don't have that problem. Well, I can share with you a very, very simple solution to your problem because I've been searching and I've come to a, a place in my life in which I'm not really affected by other people when it comes to being in social environments. Some days I am, some days I'm not, but it depends on if I've done what I'm about to share with you right now. Communication, guys, is a thing of the body. It's a physical thing. A lot of us look at communication as a very mental, intellectual kind of thing, when in reality, it is, but not so much. Because our thoughts, the words that we hear in our head, guess what? They're coursing throughout our bodies. They're vibrating in our bodies, and they're coming out of our bodies. We communicate with our bodies. So, is it more important to have all the thoughts in your head, but you know, the, the vehicle isn't all that cracked up, it's not all that powerful, it's not all that engaged in this? Or is it more important to have a very able and ready body and have a few thoughts in there you can express very well because your body's you know, strong and behind you. There's no right answer right there either. I was just trying to paint a picture for you, but get your body behind you is what I'm saying. A lot of us, and I know I experience this, have a lot of tension in our bodies. Tension in our legs, tension in our shoulders, in our necks, in our backs, in our chest, and around in our, abdo our abdominals. Get that tension out. Tension in my experience, it's nothing more than pockets of stored consciousness. It's pockets of stored energy, right? Look at the word attention. Attention, wherever you direct your attention, your energy flows. Look at the word tension. See how there's that correlation there? Tension and attention. When you get that tension out of your legs, out of your shoulders or neck, when you get that trapped energy to flow all throughout your body, you, have, you now have more energy to utilize when it comes to directing your focus and directing your attention. And now you have more creative energy to work with, especially when communicating. Notice when people have a hard time communicating, they, they get around some people and they say, wow, that guy is a stiff. He's a real stiff. Or that guy's like, he's, he's a real tight ass, you know. They, they say things of that nature because it indicates, you know, there's no coincidence there. The, the reason he's a, the reason he's, you know, he can't express himself is because his ass is tight. He's walking around with his ass tight and he's like, well, you know, he's a tight ass. So it's real simple guys, I'm going to make this video nice, simple, short, sweet to the punch. If you want to improve your, in your ability to communicate, you just have to inhabit your body. You have to get your energy coursing throughout your body. You ever, I don't know if any of you all have watched uh, Dragon Ball Z growing up, man, but I was a big fan of Dragon Ball Z. 
and and all those guys, man. If, when you look at it, that show is super true, by the way. If you if you really study it and look at it, that show has some significance. But those guys, you know, walking around, they have those big auras around them. The big, their presence is powerful. And and what are they doing? They're in their body. They're they're flexing. They're ah! and they're and you know they're in their bodies. That's all you got. You just got to be in your body. And a lot of things will be very easy for you. So, until next time, guys. If you enjoyed this video, like it, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. And until next time, y'all be easy. All right.